Nights Live Improv from New York City, 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 city. And uh, we have two prov now, a scene with EJ and Steve. So let's dive in. Uh, EJ, would you, would you like to get a suggestion? Yeah, how about a profession? A waitress. A waitress. Okay. Love it. Steve, you want anything? Um, favorite thing and a picnic basket. Fried chicken. Fried chicken. Yes, indeed. So good for you. Ah. Uh, all right. Um, tell you what we're going to do. We are going to mute our microphones so that the focus will come over to you. You start whenever you want, but uh, just to get the camera over to you, are you ready? Yes. All right. Coming. Love. <clears throat> what in God's they, name is this? They <laughs> said chicken. This isn't chicken. Oh, shit. Marvin. Yeah. Marvin. Yeah. You're, make, you're making too many mistakes. Hey. I'm over here, Marvin. When I talk to you, what? put the frying pan down and get over here. When you've been around this joint as long as I have, you'll know you got to pick the speed up. Pick it up. Well, it'd help if you put the damn food out where I can get it. I'm moving. I'm moving. <sighs> Marvin. Yeah. Keep your voice down when you're rude to me. You can be rude to me, but don't let the customers hear. What? Come on, Gladys. You know I'm hard of hearing. Marvin. What? We got the rich ones in again tonight. Oh. Okay. I want you to spit on his burger. Yeah, I'll let you do that. <coughs> he gave me the world's stingiest tip last time. Thank you. Just tell him it's a spicy mustard. <laughs> I like you. I'm beginning to like you, Marvin. Oh, that's not a good thing, Gladys. That's not a good thing. You got yourself a little ponytail going on back there, I see. Yeah, getting, I can't afford to cut the hair. Order up. Marvin, you got to wear a hairnet. That's not hygienic. I wash my hair. <laughs> Is hygienic. <laughs> Health department will have your ass and mine. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, that's for you. You're a gentleman and a scholar, Marvin. A gentleman and a scholar. Let's try. You're a good-looking man, Marvin. What? Well, thank uh, you. Looking, looking at you through the hatch now with a uh, shot of whiskey warming up me collies, and oh, <laughs> I can see the glow of chefdom around you. You look lovely all of a sudden, Marvin. What do you say, you and me, when we get off tonight down the dance hall? All right, that sounds good. <laughs> that sounds good. <laughs> <laughs> no, you crack me up, Marvin. You crack me up. Hey, hey! Get hey, what? Get away from my face. Get my fingers too close to my face. Well, come on. You said want to go down the dance hall. I gotta. Fine. I said go down the dance hall. I didn't say put your fingers all over my face. Thank you. Order up. What the hell is this? Oh, uh, that's a prescription. Excuse me. I don't have that oh, back. Sorry. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Where is this restaurant again? I, I just want to make sure I avoid it. Turn left at Goon River. <laughs> that's so it's hard. a five star restaurant, has one Michelin star. <laughs> <laughs> and one Michelin tire. Uh, thank you, EJ. And thank you, Steve. And thank you for watching. Hey, there's more improv coming at you. So just stick around. Mm -hmm.